So uh, parenting. Yeah. We assume I've got two daughters. Mm. Yeah. What would be, you know, the the one advice you give me, you know, as a brother-in-law, uh, and as a friend, what was the gem of uh, fatherhood, or being a parent? Well, yeah, it's never easy to be parent. Uh, parenting is is one of, uh, to me, one of life's uh, most interesting uh, skills. You know. Mm -hmm. Uh, every child is different. You have two daughters, so you know. Uh, I'm sure one of them are will be different from the other, and so each has their own gifting, their own, um, you know, their own design and, and their natural inclination. And if you are able to discover that and help them discover that on, uh, for themselves, um, you help them uh, uh, establish an identity, and the identity will, will help them a lot. Uh, it goes, goes a long way in their life. Yeah, as a father, I think if you can do that for them, that would be wonderful. Yeah. How, how has uh, parenthood changed you? Well, it certainly changed me from someone who's a lot more self-focused to someone who's a lot more focused on others. Um, you know, I'm not able to really communicate well with them until I understand them for who they are better. You know, if we prescribe or impose on, upon them what we want to be, very often it's going to be a, a struggle because, you know, you, you, can't, you know, you can't get them to do what they are not. You know? And if you fail to recognize what they are, then you always find yourself in a uh, conflicting position because it can never be what you want if that is something that they are not. It sounds like uh, you've come to a stage whereby, you know, you have matured as a parent. Mm. I mean, you've got three kids. Mm. Sven is sixteen, mm. and then uh, Sydney is what fourteen. Sydney is twelve. He's twelve, and then you have Sam, mm. who is nine. Uh, nine. Yeah, uh, I'm quite sure Sam would get the best of the fatherhood in that you are more experienced. <laughs> uh, you know, when, when, when Sven first came out, mm. yeah, uh, your, your expectation or the way you look at things would have been quite different. Yeah. Mm. Oh yeah, definitely. Uh, I think uh, life is a learning journey. When, 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 when Sven came along, I didn't know much about fathering except maybe what my father taught me. Uh, about 10 years ago, I took it upon myself to really learn what good fathering is all about. There are a lot of materials out there, there are a lot of people who have done well and, and you know, um, humble yourself, you know, uh, give uh, others a chance to really uh, share their experience, their, their um, wisdom. And, and you, you take that and you, you try and apply it into your own context and over time you kind of refine it and, and learn it from a very personal uh, 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 experience because... Uh, so, so you're quite a different father from a father for Sven when he was young than you are a father I, for I think so, yeah. I think uh, I was more a... a um, I think I was more dominated by how I see things from, from my work environment. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, when I was... More autocratic and strict, I suppose. I, I, I was, um, <coughs> you know, trained in the military. I was just trained in the corporate <laughs> world. And th those are the... Poor only, Sven. <laughs> those are the only things... <laughs> well... Uh, yeah, in a way, yes, but you know, being being a new father, I, I, I also did a lot of the things I thought was uh, what I wanted as a child. <laughs> so, uh, uh, may not always be a good thing, you know, I like to play, I like this and that, so there's a tendency for me to spoil him as well. So, um, I can swing from one end of, of, the, of the pendulum, you know, to mm -hmm. the ultra um, indulgence to the other side, which is the ultra. Uh, uh, control, ultra uh -huh. uh, restrictive, you know, or, or, or should I say, a militant. <laughs> so so will, you, will you say that you are more consistent and balanced father right now? Oh yeah, yeah. I think one of the, ch in fact, one of the very important aspects of good fathering is really about consistency. Uh -huh. I think, um, you know, if you swing from one to the other, the, the, the child is not able to really understand what it means uh, or how to react to you at any point in time and, and that can be quite distressing and after a while if they find it too much they will just just lose you automatically because 
you're not you're not getting any any relief. You know? so, so you need to be consistent. You know, you, you can be strict, but at least you're consistently strict and in the, in the right way, I think. Uh, and if they understand that, and they understand um, uh, the reason why you're doing uh, what you do, and, and uh, it may work well for them, even if it's being strict.